Hi, this is Rondelman. Rondel. I uh, just got done making a, um, a mount for a camera or for the Yukon Night Ranger to fit on top of my telescope and hold it steady. And this is a picture of it. I went to a site called, um, maybe you can catch it here, it's astronomyhints.com piggyback HTML and they had a picture of one in there you sort of see it, it's a little different than mine but and uh, I'll show you the other page that's what it's supposed to look like when it's done see that little wooden block in there oh, where the camera sits on and uh, there they had a strap going around your telescope and attached to and that's what this thing looked like okay well my neighbor couldn't cut that fancy uh, thing uh, cut on the wood a 2x4 so mine looks similar but like this it's it's sort of cut square okay he cut it a little high but it works and I put some brackets on the end little corner L-shaped brackets you can see one here and uh, I have the bolt running up through the bottom and this will sit right on the telescope and then I'll strap it down with um, well you can either use these metal bands and tighten it up or I'm going to first use velcro, velcro strapping uh, that just goes around and doesn't scar up the telescope tube okay so it's a block of wood 2x4 uh, 5 inches long I did I got this bolt sitting here and this little wing nut will screw up against the camera you screw the camera on first and then you turn that wing nut to tighten it up against the camera okay and that's how that's going to work or it's how it's supposed to work there's a side view of it and I also put rubber little strips of rubber on everything that could touch the uh, telescope tube you see and the rubber is thin you can get it from anywhere I happen to use an old boot one of my wife's boots and I'm sure that she wouldn't mind if she knew about it but anyway just cut a little off the top of it she could still use it. the zipper may not work quite right but anyway um, I'll show you a picture of this when I have the Yukon mounted on top okay later okay this is Rondo again aka Rondo Mon from Jamaica anyway uh, this is the uh, telescope mount for my Yukon with the Yukon now mounted on top and you can see how that little wing nut came up right on the bottom there and tightened up and now this will sit on top of the telescope as one unit I'll hook my video to it and now I can aim my telescope through a video viewfinder which is now being has a Yukon as its uh, source of input okay talk to you later this is Rondo Mon Rondo this is the Yukon now mounted on top of the Mead ETX LS6 telescope you can see it up there and the uh, infrared illuminator is uh, still covered so you just have the eyeball looking out in the lens and I'll take it around the side here so you can see how it's mounted I've got that block up on the top there I'm using um, velcro strapping here and it's got it snug down pretty good and uh, you can see the little uh, wing nut that's clamped up onto the Yukon now I may have to adjust it up or down a little um, because the Yukon doesn't sit straight it sits at a little angle I don't know if you can see that it's looking up a little uh, anyway 